This is 23 News at 5. As a 44-year-old man accused of kidnapping and killing 10-year-old Destiny Huggins appears in Winnebago County Court for the first time, 23 News has learned that Antonio Monroe is a person of interest in a separate death investigation in Schaumburg. Police there say they want to talk to Monroe about his possible role in the death of a woman found July 5th in a Schaumburg hotel room. 23 News reporter Jake Pearson was in court today where the judge sets Monroe's bond at $5 million. In the courtroom, prosecutors called for bond to be set at $5,000, but due to Monroe's extremely high risk to public safety and prior bond release recently, Judge Paganini increased that price significantly. New court details suggest Monroe allegedly stole a car in Schaumburg, Illinois, before driving to Rockford last Saturday. Monroe then supposedly lured Huggins and her six-year-old sister into the backyard of a Rockford home before kidnapping and murdering Huggins. Whitney Rouse is a family friend and organizer of a GoFundMe page for Huggins' funeral costs. She expresses her emotion toward the alleged killer. A monster, just disgusting, and, and that's just putting it nicely because I can't say what I want to say or even speak what the family wants to say and speak. Um, it's just disgusting and sad that we even have to now protect our children from be playing in their front yard from monsters like this. A correction, that's actually $500,000 bond originally until it was moved up to $5 million. If convicted, Monroe will spend at least 30 years in the Department of Corrections and a maximum of 60 years in prison for his crimes. Monroe's next court date is set for August 15th in the Winnebago County Criminal Justice Center. A link for Huggins' GoFundMe page is posted on our website.